Let's create a curved path in Maya. Start by going to the top view and using your Bezier curve to create a gently curving path. Hit the Enter key to stop drawing the path. Now select Edit and Duplicate and move the duplicate path to the side. Next we'll want to make connection curves. With the Bezier Curve tool, as close as you can get to the endpoints, click and click to the other side. Hit Enter to finish that path. Repeat the same process at the bottom. Be very careful to get as close to that endpoint as you can without going above it or inside of it, or you may have problems connecting or attaching the line units. Select all the line units under Curves, select Attach, and the Options menu. We'll want to connect, uncheck Keep Originals. Also on Multiple Knots, Remove. Click the Attach button. With the line still selected, under Surfaces, select Planar and Options. Select Polygons and Quads. And click the Planar Trim button. If it doesn't fill in, you may need to go back to Curves and Open and Close Path. Once your polygon has been created, in face mode select all of the faces, edit mesh, and extrude. Extrude the faces to give it a little depth. Turn to object mode. Duplicate your path and move it out of the way. Back from the top view, create a plain polygon primitive. It's best to let the path extend beyond the polygon primitive. Also, you want to make sure that the two objects actually intersect each other. Now select the plane. Shift select the path and mesh boolean difference. This should remove that path right out of your plane. You can now take the duplicate and position it. You want to select the edges and bevel them to round the path and then you can add the path materials to the path and the grass materials to the surrounding ground. 